All right, so for our first game, these boys are gonna put this, their spoons in their mouth and they're gonna try to transfer ping pong balls from one container to the next. Now, you can use your hands to stabilize your containers because uh, these are pretty flimsy, so they're kind of moving all over the place. But other than that, you can't use your hands to pick up the ping pong balls. The first person to get all five into their empty containers will win. All right, are you guys ready? Yep. On your mark, get set, go. And Noah is the winner. All right, so for this next round, we're gonna have them do something similar but a little bit different. They'll keep the spoon in their mouth, but they'll be able to use their hand to put the ping pong ball on their spoon, and then they'll carry it down and put it in one of their buckets. The first person to get all five in will win. Are y'all ready? On your mark, get set, go. a close one. Oh, and Ezra won by one ping pong ball. All right, so for this next game, it's kind of like a bowling golf hybrid game where they will use their spoons to try to um, hit the ball into these buckets. All right, are you ready? Yeah. On your mark, get set, go. All right, if it doesn't go in, you got to retrieve your ball and go back to the starting line. A few moments later. Much, much, much later. All right, so in that game, maybe it's best just to use like three balls instead of five, because every time they'd get three in, then one would pop out. But it was still a lot of fun. They did a lot better than I thought they were going to.